and then also with a side of just what are you doing trying to carry the shelves upstairs all right now is the time sitting down to dinner let's put the shelves upstairs <laughs> Good morning, guys. So we had a glorious, glorious, relaxing Saturday morning. I feel like we haven't just had a nice, normal, like, wake up. I feel like I keep saying this over the past couple of days, but, like, we just haven't had, like, a normal at-home weekend in so long. Yeah. So it was so nice just having a nice and slow, relaxing Saturday morning at home. And um, we, uh, I got Miles to look over the donor that I found last night because, like I said, he didn't really read all the, like, specific stuff like I was. What would you think? Yeah. <laughs> I like don't them? really know. I mean, like, what am I supposed to be like? It's so hard. I, I'm like, I don't really need to know where you went to school, I feel like, but like... Oh yeah. God. It's hard, like, pulling out the information that, like, would matter, like, because what I like about him is he seems very well-rounded, so he has, like, aspects about him that are very, like, you know, brainy and smart, but also, like, you know, kind of hands-on, like, working, like, um, and also, like, creativity, and you know what I mean? Yeah. And, I don't know, I just really, like feel like I connected with it and like a lot of it like a lot of his characteristics reminded me of Miles and like I don't know but Which it is, is what weird we were going for I guess yeah exactly but it is weird like I like I actually posted I found a Facebook group for people who um are like going through either like egg or sperm donors and using that fertility help what are you doing dude um and so I posted in there, like, asking, so, like, how did you guys, like, know when you found, like, the one? <laughs> you know what I mean? And, um, yeah, basically they all said, like, kind of what we've been talking about is, like, that the characteristics reminded them of, like, you know, their partner or whatever who they were trying to yeah. emulate. And, yeah, so, yeah, but it is a weird thing. I Like, it's a weird thing. Like, you can't just be like, yeah, that's, like, I don't know. Yeah. It just feels weird, like, pulling the trigger. But, yeah, we really like him. You seem to really like him, too. Yeah. And Sorry, cute I, little... had, I have a headache. So. Oh, yeah, he has a headache, so... That was, like, repeated what you said. <laughs> but, um... You do that a lot. I know. <laughs> but, yeah, so, um, we actually got Miles to, like, read through the whole, um... We got, like, 25 pages of information on this guy, plus a baby picture, and... Yeah, we really like him so far. So we're obviously just going to kind of sit with it for a little bit, I think. You know, we're not, like, buying anything today. Yay. But, yeah. And anyways, obviously, we are out and about in the car, and we are heading to... Where are we going first? Uh, Ikea. We're going to Ikea because um, I thought of an idea that I really want to do for one of the walls in the house, and so we need a trip to Ikea to accomplish that, and I'll show you guys what I'm talking about later, but I'm really excited about it because it's one of the walls that I wasn't really sure what to do with, and that kind of just, like, hit me one day, and I was like, yes, that's it. <laughs> so we're going to do that. So we got the car all packed up, and then Miles went back in to get us some treaties. Ooh, it has chocolate in it? No, it's a cinnamon one. It has cinnamon in it. Oh. <laughs> it looked like chocolate. Mm. So good. So, Miles got a cinnamon bun, and then we also got two slushies. You can see right there. Apparently I got... Ikea does slushies now. What? I said apparently Ikea does slushies. I know, right? It's really good. I got like a lemonade one. It's really, really good. It's not like overly sweet. It's like really good. What'd you get? I don't know. Lingonberry. Ah, right. Yeah. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Can I try it? 
strawberry. Oh good, yeah you're right, it is like strawberry-ish. I saw that one but I wasn't sure exactly what lingonberry was so I went with lemonade. And I'm happy with my decision, but good to know for future reference. <laughs> And now where are we off to? Are we going to the garden store or where else do we have to go? Lowe's. We're going to Lowe's. All right, so we just got back from Lowe's and we got a bunch of fun thing at, things at both Ikea and Lowe's. So I thought I would quickly walk you through all the stuff we got because we're going to be doing stuff outside. So yeah, but I just wanted to do a really quick haul and show you all the fun stuff we got. <laughs> so first we got these three like picture frame ledge shelf things that we will be using in the living room and they'll probably go up tomorrow. So I'll show you guys what we have in mind for them then. I also got this really cute little like plate thing that I've had my eye on forever that was in the as is section for $2.50, which I thought was a pretty good deal. So I got one of them. We also got a pillow that I'm gonna be using on the entryway bench. I've been wanting to get like a long skinny pillow like this for that spot for a long time. And again, this is in as is. As was this. <laughs> we really got all sorts of stuff in as is today. This was only $10. I think the pillow was like six fifty dollars or something. And we got the blanket because all of our blankets are like this really thick, fuzzy blankets. We don't really have any like kind of lighter cotton blanket. And so we got this for that purpose. Uh, Miles also got himself a couple of beer, I think these are Pilsner glasses, because he has those other kinds of beer glasses that he uses, but he says that they're not like the kind that you use all the time for every beers. I don't know. Anyways, he got four of these. <laughs> and I also got a little um, vase type thing that matches that platter, and this was I think like two dollars. Yeah, two dollars. And then we also got a whole bunch of fun stuff at Lowe's. So first thing we got was a couple bags of mulch, which Miles is applying as we speak. Hello, Munchkin, you wanna say hi? Oh, did he get you some water? Hi, did he get you some water? Hello, hello, I missed you too. So yeah, we got some more black mulch that we're just gonna spread out in the rest of the yard because we just didn't have quite enough when we first put it all out. <laughs> oh, and one more thing we got at Ikea. We got um, a $15, it's only $35, but we got for $15. It was the um, umbrella stand. We never ended up getting an umbrella for our table, but we were kind of like planning on it next summer, I guess. But since it was so discounted, we decided to just go ahead and get it now, and we'll get the actual like umbrella whenever we need it next summer or later this summer. I don't know, but we have the stand already for that. And then we also got the world's cutest little bird feeder at Lowe's, and I'm so excited because so my mom came over the other day, and I'm not sure you're gonna be able to see it, but next to the shed, see if I can get a better angle. Kind of right there, that like big tall metal thing, shepherd's crook, shepherd's hook, something like that. Um, my mom gave it to us and so we wanted to put a cute little bird feeder on there and I think this is just literally the cutest thing in the world, so we got that. And then we also got ourselves some bird feeder. We got a shell-free variety so that it doesn't make a big mess under the feeder. And this one is supposed to attract titmice, grosbeaks, nuthatches, cardinals, and more. So I think that'll be really, really fun to um, add into our yard. And last but not least, Miles got himself a fun new um, <laughs> yard tool. So we got this Black & Decker, um, hold on, let me see. Black & Decker, uh, what's it called, Weed Backer, I think. So to kind of go around the edges of our yard where he can't quite get with um, the lawnmower and to also go around the edges of like the patio and stuff and the gardens and it'll just be like really, really useful. And it was only $30, which I think is really reasonable. So yeah, that's all we got. Now I think we are going to install the bird feeder. Miles is doing the mulch and yeah, spend some time outside because it's been a while since we've done that. We spent like a good, oh, you were probably all muddy and I'm wearing a white shirt. <laughs> oh, I'd say hour and a half at least hanging outside, um, working on the yard. We got the bird feeder up. I did a whole bunch of weeding. Miles got all the uh, mulch down. I trimmed back like our bleeding heart because it had died back for the season. I de-weeded all of our stairs going down the side of the house. They're all like brick. They're like, like our patio. And so they were getting really like completely covered in weeds. And so I went down the whole stairway and like pulled out all the weeds and so 
Here, I'll show you. I don't want to get up though, but you can kind of see the first couple of stairs to see what I'm talking about. And I was just going to tell you that Miles actually ran out to get us dinner, but he just drove back up with dinner. So we're gonna... yeah. And we sound the alarm every time Dad comes home. <laughs> so we are going to go head on inside and eat. So we got sushi for dinner and I'm so excited because sushi is like our thing. We went and got sushi all the time when we started dating and we haven't actually gotten like legit sushi in a while, I feel like. It's been a while. Yeah, so I got a black dragon roll, which is shrimp tempura. Uh, I think avocado inside and then eel on the top with eel sauce. What did you get? Um, shrimp tempura, cream cheese, smoked salmon. Ooh, that sounds good. And then also with a side of just, what are you doing? Trying to carry the shelves Trying to carry the shelves upstairs, all right. Now is the time, sitting down to dinner, let's put the shelves upstairs. <laughs> um, but then we also got a side of just like straight up shrimp tempura that we're gonna split. And I am so hungry after doing all that yard work, I cannot wait to dig in. And of course, as per usual, we will be binging scandal on this evening. <laughs> all right, we're making the responsible decision of going to bed at midnight instead of watching one more episode and going to bed at one, even though we really want to. Really want to. But we're making the responsible decision and going to bed, like adults. <laughs> um, yeah, don't really have much else to add. Today was good. Yeah, we had a really good day. I like, we had a really good day. That pile of crap. That pile. Was I showing the right stuff? I don't know. That stuff. <laughs> yeah, that's all the stuff that Miles' parents dropped off, but like, it's his old junk. Like, my parents dropped off my old junk from their attic, and he just has to, still has to go through it all and find out what he wants to keep and get rid of the rest. And yep. Yep, so hopefully we'll get to that tomorrow. Are you ready for bed? Huh? I'm ready for bed. I'm sleepy. Sleepy, sleepy. Yep. All right. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't I get to cut the grass tomorrow. What? Get to cut the grass tomorrow. You get to cut the grass tomorrow and use your fancy new edger. <clears throat> Weed whacker. Weed whacker. Sorry. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night.